Hey Budgeties, welcome to my YouTube channel. So if you are new, thank you so much for joining. I wanna say hey to all the new subscribers, hey. Um, if you're new and you're a new subscriber, make sure you comment below, let me know your name, like what's your, what, what's your financial goal, your financial freedom journey. I'm so interested and I'm so grateful, genuinely grateful to have not just the new subscribers, but the subscribers I already have. You guys know I'm on my road to 5,000 subscribers for the year 2022. I'm speaking into existence. I'm letting y'all know it's going to happen. And I really do appreciate you guys for joining the crew. Um, so in this video, you guys, I'm going to go over my 2022 savings uh, for January, right? So I've introduced my uh, savings financial freedom challenge goals and tracker planner. It's such a mouthful, but ooh, chile. Um... I've introduced it before. This is available to be printed off of paperbymo.com. If you want it, bind it. Let your girl know. Like, if it's enough people in the comments telling me, girl, we want this binded, I'll do it. I will. I'll do it for y'all. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm going to go over my January. My January. Um, and I know it's kind of late, but you know what? Late is better than never. And anyways, I've been working towards it. I just haven't, like, defined it to you all, if that makes any type of sense. Um, also, Martin Luther King Jr. Day is coming, approaching, and I will have a discount and a sale going on paperbymo.com. So make sure you guys go check that out. And if you guys are interested, make sure you stay tuned. Okay, so the first page, I went ahead and did it off camera. Just filling in, just to catch you guys up real quick. My name is Mo. Hey. <laughs> I'm on my journey to being financially free. My fi my financial freedom looks like five lucrative incomes, five figure months. Um, let's put a let's put a, a S on this month because I mean months, not a month, but all the months. Okay, amen. And then no debt. So what is my finance? My financial negatives are student loans. My positives are a paid off car. Yes, I did. Multiple incomes. I do. And paid off credit cards. And I also have that. And what is my motivation? My God, because won't he do it? And my future family, like my future spouse and kids and grandkids, I want them to be able to um, reap the benefits of their mother, grandmother, wife, whomever, um, not having debt. So bam. Okay, and then you guys see my net worth statement. Then I have the 2022 calendar in here. Okay, so goals. So for the goals, just gonna get on some of my handy dandy, beautiful paper by Mo budget planner. Anywho, and I'm gonna go into the goals. So my goal for January is to save 600 and to pay 600 towards debt. Daily sales, paperbymo.com. Weekly ties to God and side hustle income of seven hundred dollars. Chalet, let me tell you about that. So I'm gonna write down save debt and side hustle. So we're gonna say save six hundred debt six hundred and then side hustle seven hundred. <clears throat> Okay, that's my monthly goals. Okay, so then my next page is my saving goals tracker. Right here. And basically, you just list all the different types of saving goals you have. So first things first, I'm going to do my EF, which is my emergency fund. And then I'm going to do his and hers, which is his and hers challenge. Um, I do have my $1 challenge. I, I'm going to explain my challenges that I'm going to have, but actually, I'll just go ahead and do that now. So, for the challenges that I am partaking in this year, and they will all be incorporated into this book. So, let me explain. This book, right, it doesn't have specific challenges. What it has is, like, trackers and games you can play to save, emergency fund, like, things you can color in, things like that, right? But, so, number one, coin challenge right i'm gonna do that this is gonna be a part of my savings number two i made this cute jar i don't know who i thought i was but i did what i had to do and this is gonna be my one dollar savings right <clears throat> it looks like a lot but i'm sure it's probably not that much we're only in the second week going on third week of january so yes yeah, so one dollar savings coin savings um i do my his and hers as you all know 
um, and then 52 week savings. So where you save um, the number of dollars for the number of weeks in the year. One first week of the year, one dollar, second week of the year, two dollars, third week of the year, three dollars, boom, just like that. Um, so I think right now this is, has three dollars for the first two weeks. And then my his and her challenge, like I already said, I have an extra savings plan, which let's see where that's located. Where or the extra savings plan. Okay, so a 30 day challenge to place anything from a penny or more to your savings. And it's 30 days and basically I'll choose a month to do this and then put that money in here. I mean, you guys like these? I made these new little label things. I love the little, um, I don't even know what you call this, like a little sandpaper looking. It's just cute. It's giving everything. So, and then coin savings. So because I know my coin jar is kind of little, I will eventually cash it in, get the cash, put it in my coin savings. And then money bingo was the game you guys saw where you can like roll a die, which is singular for dice because people have corrected me. <laughs> um, money bingo, roll a die and you know, you for 25 days and you choose one and however much you choose is what you have to save. And this one is more money bingo. So that means it's going to be a total of $465 and that will be for one month. So that was a mouthful. I know. So I'm going to go ahead and write, I, I, I. so back to the savings goal tracker, I have my emergency fund, which I'm going to put money towards every check every month, my his and hers, which goes for every check. And then we're going to do 52 weeks, which I'm going to do 52 uh, W. And then we're going to do, what else do we have? Extra savings plan, um, coin savings and money bingo. So I'm gonna do not gonna really do coin savings or um the dollar challenge because I'm not gonna try to count the dollars until later, but I will do money bingo. So I'm just gonna put bingo here, right? For whatever month that is, so I can just calculate just so we can like keep up with all the money that we've been saving all year. And then I'm gonna do the extra right here. I'm just going to put extra. Okay, so emergency fund, his and hers, 52-week challenge, money bingo, and the extra savings plan. Um, did I miss anything? Oh, maybe the coins. I should do the coin one, huh? For like maybe when I cash it in. I don't know. I'm gonna. We'll see about the coin one. But this is what I have thus far. This is, oh, also, I don't know if I even showed you guys my cute little 2022 savings binder that I made for myself. And then, you know, I tried, I tried. I love the little, like, reflection or whatever. It's cute. Okay, so that that's the savings, and those are the savings, those trackers. And so at the end of every month, when I do, like, my recap, I'll go ahead and, like, plus or minus. God forbid it's minus. But let's say plus each one and how much I save. Oh, Okay, so then we have side hustle money. This is another tracker. So for week one um, of January, um, I did zero dollars. <laughs> so I didn't make any money. Um, and then we'll do week two, week three, week four, week five, whatever. And then how much total income was the side hustle money for the month. And I'm excited for this. I don't think I'm going to do my paper by mo because I also have a business planner. So I think I'm going to keep it all in there. But to be determined. Because <laughs> your girl don't know. Okay. And then we have debt goal tracker. And for this one, I'm just going to put student loans. Because right now, that's all I have. But like if I were to have a car to pay off, boom or I don't know, dental, whatever, put everything there. And then whatever I pay towards it, I'll list for each month. So there we have that. So this was just like a little fun game. Find as many words as you can in the word hunt. Real simple. Okay. Ooh, I'm excited about this. So my emergency fund, you guys. So my goal for my emergency fund is $10,000. Now there's 70 of them. And I'm sure I could do this in my head. But I don't want to divide it by 70. That means that each one, I'm going to say, is $143. Okay, $143. Now, right now, I have $3,800 in my emergency fund. So, 
divided by three eight zero zero. Can I do that? No. So three eight zero zero divided by one four three. So it should be twenty six and a half of these colored in. But again, I'll do these at like the end of the month. And then so we have home fund. Also, also. Um I'm also gonna do ten thousand dollars. <laughs> and I'm laughing because <laughs> I have $60 right now. So, but let's just divide. So 10,000 divided by 25. Each house is $400. So I don't even have a house yet. And that's okay. That's okay. Um, I'm not mad at this. This is something new that I was thinking of. So not mad at all. Um, I guess I'll count this at the end of the year with this, but for the meanwhile, there is nothing. Same thing with like the saving tracker, elevating saving tracker. I'll just make up something. Um, my January, I'm not January, I'm sorry, like my extra savings plan, I'll choose a month when to do it. I'll choose a month when to do this one as well and figure out what I want to put it towards. And then so... Blank and blank saving challenge. I'm trying to figure out. I'm going to just say his and hers because I was trying to figure out if I want to put me in my booth's name. But no. So we've already done week one and week two. And what I'm going to do also is like in my, um, my his and her challenge thing, I'm going to go ahead and print out another one and put it. Uh, like a small one to put also in in the envelope if that makes sense so I can just track it in there and keep it cute keep it cute and classy same thing with the 52 savings I'm gonna go ahead and print out one that's small that can fit in the a6 envelope and put it in there let's see what else I saw I put two in there for one for the one and one for the other um student loan debt tracker now we're getting into the debt section, and the year is 2022. So at the end of the month, I'm going to say how much I um, my balance was and go color up from there. And I don't really have a minimum payment, but yeah. I'll put this, um, update this with the rest of my monthly debt. And then this is another one, extra debt payoff for one month for 30 days. Place anything from a penny or more to your debt. So I'll choose when to do that. I'm not really going to, I don't have an envelope for this because my goal is not to store that cash. You know what I mean? Like I'm trying to put that cash towards the debt effective immediately because I think the thing over, the thing is over like in May. So what the next month, June, you got to pay. So yeah. No. And then credit card debt tracker does not apply um just a regular lemonade debt tracker and then we get into the monthlies Ugh, i want these okay so my goal for this is just to save um, i know i can save 600 see i'm trying to put a goal where i know that's harder for me so i'm gonna say side hustle and it's gonna be 700 mm, yikes okay so for it's gonna it's 56 calendars so we're gonna say 700 divided by five six. That's twelve dollars and fifty cents. Okay, that's my goal. And basically, at the end of the month, I reach the whole goal. I color it in. It's a tracker, coloring tracker. And then I have one for every month: February, March, April, May, June, so forth and so on. But yeah, this is. This is what your girl has. Oh, and then at the end of the year, go ahead and do net worth statements. Una mas. So, January's saving challenges one more time. Boom. Shakalaka. The coins. Um, 52 week savings. Obviously, these are all year, but I'm just re restating it. Um, this has $3. His and hers. And then dollar saving so let me tell y'all about this dollar saving stuff right because i've struggled with the thought of doing this because i'm like so y'all want me to save every extra dollar i have because i need them dollars like them dollars need me <laughs> but i really am just like you know what 
let me just put let me go beside myself and try this so and i don't know maybe it's ten dollars because you know it can look like a lot in here and it really could be a whole bunch of nothing so i'm excited i'm excited to see how much i can actually save and put it together um for the end of the year and put in my savings or put towards i don't know investing or whatever it is um so yeah that was my january savings guys I know it's a little late, but you know what? Late is better than never. And you guys, again, if you're a new subscriber, make sure you introduce yourself below. Thank you guys so much for watching my YouTube videos. Also, go ahead and tell me what is your January's um, saving trackers or saving challenges that you guys are participating in. I would love to know. Put me on to something because, you know, I, I need to know more. But I will talk to you guys in the next video. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, and make sure you subscribe, and tell your friend, okay? Be like, friend, I know this one girl, her name is Mo, and she be budgeting, okay? <laughs> um, tell them to join the crew, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!